There's been a lot of media hype recently about the future of cars, the future of road transport. And some headlines are declaring that the autonomous self-driving car is with us and it's going to arrive in the very near future. And other headlines suggest that the technology companies such as Apple and Google are going to replace the major car makers such as GM, Toyota, Ford and so on. I think both notions are seriously misguided. There's no doubt that there's a great future for autonomous cars and in 15 or 20 years they will be with us. But in the meantime, cars are just going to get smarter and they're going to have a far better communications network ability. Inside cars, we're going to have data from internally about the systems, the economy and so on. We're going to collect data from outside about traffic, etc. But we're also going to collect data about us, the drivers, about our biometrics and how we're doing in charge of a vehicle. Now, as our cars become smarter and with more semi-automated features, assisting convoy travelling, parking, uh, bad weather radar and so on, we're going to see real changes in the powertrain, in the way that cars and trucks and buses are actually powered in the engines. We're going to see a move to hybrid vehicles more and more, where there's a mix of petrol and electric. We're going to see some all-electric cars with increased range, although that remains a problem. And we're going to see a continued use of the internal combustion engine, although that may become much more efficient through the, light, through the use of things like laser ignition systems, which replace conventional spark plugs. These technologies are likely to reduce greenhouse gases significantly and extend fuel economy. At the same time, the highways themselves are going to become much more smart. Lamppost will speak to lamppost, lamppost will speak to car, car will speak to road, road will speak to car, and perhaps most importantly, cars and trucks and buses will all be talking to each other, exchanging data about road conditions. Over the next five years, we'll begin to see road automation creeping in, perhaps some lanes or some sections of highways, but automation in terms of self-driving is not going to happen until the mid-2020s for reasons of safety, reliability and above all the legal and liability issues. These can be overcome but there's a lot of work that's still to be done. The future of the car, of personal transport and of the truck and of the bus remains bright. Expect these vehicles to, be up, to become more communicative. Expect them to become much more fuel efficient. Expect them to go on being even more appealing or even more functional in the case of commercial vehicles. But for the moment, the media hype about dramatic changes in road technology is just that, media hype. Do expect the big manufacturers I've mentioned before, Ford, Toyota, GM, Volkswagen, etc., to bring in many more smart features, both for your convenience as a driver and indeed for communications and economy purposes. But I do not believe there's going to be any major change in the automotive landscape in the next 15 or 20 years beyond those things I've mentioned.